So in this video, I'll show you how to update your drivers for your Windows 7 and Windows 10. Drivers are the software that interfaces between the operating system and your hardware and makes the hardware function or get interpreted by the operating system correctly. If you're running really old drivers on your system, you can have performance impacts you can have crashes, you can have security vulnerabilities that exist. So ensuring that your drivers are updated with Windows Hardware Quality Labs tested drivers will ensure that your hardware has full functionality with the minimal chance of having drivers uh, cause a blue screen or a crash. There are also security implications when running old drivers such as NVIDIA drivers and there is a vulnerability in the older NVIDIA drivers that allow remote execution of code on your system so you should always update your drivers to the latest and greatest and this tool called snappy driver installer will allow you to update your drivers for Windows 2000, XP, Vista 7, 8, 8.1, and 10. I've tested it on Windows 7 and Windows 10, and it detected every piece of hardware that I had. It's free, it's portable. You can, you can copy this to a USB drive, and it's open source, so you know you're not getting uh, any spyware. The source code is readily available. So when you go to download this, you can either download the full package, which is 17 gig, and that's a torrent download, or you can download just the program, and then it'll check your hardware and download only the driver packs that you need. And that's the one that I downloaded here. The thing you want to do is create a restore point. So I'll name this like pre-SDI, just to have a, a restore point to fall back to if something goes bad. So after the restore points created, close that. If you're running a 32-bit system, you can run this one. If you're running a 64-bit system, use the X64. And it will tell you what hardware you have that is missing the drivers. If you, so this is the various pieces of hardware that need to be updated or have updated drivers and if you hover your mouse over the hardware this window will pop up and in the left side of the screen it shows you your hardware ID like the PCI VEN underscore 1022 dev 780 and then on the right side it shows you the updated available driver so for instance for this piece of hardware the the AS media SATA controller on my motherboard it's being controlled by a Microsoft driver, which is not always the best alternative or the, the most efficient. On the right side, you see that AS Media Technology has an updated driver from two years ago. And I'm, this one, the Microsoft is from 2006. Hit select all and install. And it will create a restore point and download the various packages and all the drivers that are downloaded are downloaded to this folder the drivers folder and this folder can be backed up to a, a NAS or, or a USB hard drive or an external U, a hard drive if you have another computer to go to you don't have to re-download the packages snappy driver installer is open source and free to use doesn't contain any spyware or, or backdoors that uh, the other questionable software does have uh, something that stays resident in your system and runs in the background and sits there and listens to you or everything you do on your computer after you install it. So now all the drivers are installed. Now we can reboot the system. So after the reboot, I'll rerun this and uh, check to make sure all the drivers got updated. It'll tell you all your drivers are updated. The AS Media 106 SATA controller was the one that had the Microsoft driver on it. Now it has an AS Media technology from the 
manufacturer of that hardware. It's also a uh, Windows hardware compatibility publisher, which means the driver is certified through Microsoft and AS Media actually probably pays Microsoft to certify their drivers. If you want to download all the driver packs and, and copy it to like a, a NAS server or a file server or an external hard drive and you just walk around and plug this utility into your, your computers and uh, update them, well, this you can download everything and it's 18.2 gig. Or if you've ever looked in your device manager and you had a uh, device that uh, showed up as a exclamation mark or a question mark and you couldn't find the drivers for the life of you, this utility will help. It will look up your hardware ID against a database of certified drivers and then download that driver for you and install it. So that is a huge benefit of making installation of certified drivers which are way less likely to crash your system than uh, downloading it from uh, some place that you don't know is uh, trusted or not. So using this utility, the Snappy Driver Installer, you're able to download the drivers for your hardware. Even if you don't know what your hardware is, this will install it. It'll look up the hardware ID against the database and download and install the drivers for you. If you found the Snappy Driver Installer useful, it is made by volunteers in their spare times. Uh, drop by their Patreon page and drop them a few bucks.